Okay, so looking at an upper limb model now showing some of the muscles around the shoulder region. Firstly, here we have pectoralis major. Now, we don't have all of it. We've got the clavicular head here and part of the sternocostal head here. So that's pectoralis major, two parts there. We have the deltoid here where we have anterior, middle and posterior fibres. We have a tiny little bit of uh, trapezius here attaching to the acromion and spine of the scapula but not the entire structure. Then posteriorly we have the supra, sorry, supraspinatus muscle we can just see part of here, infraspinatus here and then teres minor, the last little bundle of fibres here coming from the posterior scapula. Here's the much larger teres major attaching to a more anterior position on the humerus. On the anterior surface we can see the subscapularis muscle and then distal to that again, teres major. We can just see part of um, the latissimus dorsi here, so just the tendon and a few muscle fibres there. Anterior to that we have the coracobrachialis attaching to the coracoid process and then the middle uh, part of the shaft, medial surface of the shaft of the humerus. And that um, proximally here blends with the tendon of the short head of biceps brachii. So there you can't separate them where they attach to the coracoid process.